when the world stopped because of COVID-19. We kept moving, swiftly converting hundreds of academic programs online, transitioning to remote exams and graduation ceremonies for our students. To 20 graduating class of the we maintained our core business with persistence and commitment from our caring university community. During a time that threatened to disrupt, we continued skillfully building our academic reputation as a first-class, globally respected enterprise deepening strategies to accelerate non-government revenue generation. It was the year we advanced our strategic plan from reputation revolution to revenue acceleration. We secured triple first, breaking into top spots on global ranking lists published by the prestigious Times Higher Education, top 1% of universities in the Latin America and Caribbean region top 1% of Golden Age universities and the number one position as the only Caribbean university to be ranked. Meanwhile, we confronted the decline of our income as a publicly funded university and undertook the business of enhancing revenue generation. An entrepreneurial exercise was set in motion and we rolled out a new financial plan to take us through to 2025. The UWI is now in a good strategic position to erase its current deficit. The past academic year has been one of the most challenging throughout our seven-decade history. Yet, we launched, pivoted, informed the Caribbean's response, contributed medicine and science, added value, advocated for justice, exceeded targets, celebrated, and remained dedicated to achieving our strategic goals. Now we're stronger, more agile, more focused, and more efficient because of it, and onto a path of a revenue revolution. Read the Vice Chancellor's full report to University Council at www.uwi.edu forward slash VC report.